And it's May 29th. It's like 7 a.m. Taking off from, I think it's McOliver's Spring. There's a cabin there. There's a whole bunch of us there last night. Not in the cabin. Chad and I actually tried to stay in the cabin. And there's rats. So as soon as we shut the door and said goodnight, we had our headlights on and there's rats jumping around. It was really nice. So we had to pack up at like 10 o'clock after we had a fire and shit and go try to find camp. We were walking the road and it was windy and we ended up finding camp and setting up and Chad woke me up this morning. He was up and at it early. So he's already on the road trying to get down to Walker Pass. We're 8.2 miles from Walker Pass and his trekking pole is supposed to be hidden behind like some monument or something down there. 709 to all my 709ers out there. I believe that might be Olancha Peak. Could be lying to you. And that down there would be the start of the Sierra. Just came from back there all around off the top of this ridge. And we are headed this way. There is Walker Pass. I recognize this mountain, I've drove by it so many times. Hiker trash! <laughs> White chocolate. I'm about to quit the PCT because I lost my sunglasses, trekking poles, and my sleeping socks. So, I'm about to go back down this fucking hill. But he's still got his vagina. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're at Walker Pass. Chad's having his period. We gotta climb this beast. This is trailhead out windy it's hot hopefully some clouds come in like yesterday but this is a steep one there he is there he is he got his hundred push-ups in and then we both died took all our energy all right it's a mean hill I gotta turn this off but we're going up there and then somewhere across Seven miles uphill. Been coming up this hill for quite a while. It's mountain. That's Walker Pass way down there. That goes out to Ridgecrest, Mojave, LA, the 14 freeway. And then if you were to go right, you'd go into Lake Isabella, Kernville. And we are headed this way to Kennedy Meadows. Another good afternoon with some cool clouds that came over right before we climbed the big ass hill. You can see the trails over there. I'd see white chocolate any second. He's up ahead. Oh, that's him right there. He's going for it. White chocolate! <laughs> right on. Yeah, it's a cool valley. Pretty cool. It's cool because I've been coming by here my whole entire life. I've never come up these hills. All right, I just made it to the saddle. So that back there is where I came up. Woo! And there's looking up the Sierras. And it looks like we're gonna get rained on again. And we got dumped on pretty hard for a good 20, 30 minutes yesterday. So. I want to be ready today. 
Yeah, you can see it's gonna be coming down. 12.30. I think I got about 12 miles in right now. Whew, we got our 100 push-ups in. That break, that killed us. A little sore from yesterday, but got my 100 in. But yeah, we're, I'm at 6,300 feet, still climbing. We're gonna go all the way up to 7,300 feet. And that's probably when that storm's gonna attack me. All right, I'm at 6,600 feet. It's around one o'clock. Got my rain jacket on, just got sprinkled on pretty hard. Looks like I'm clear for a minute. Have it on, but wide open. Um, and this is the ridge here, and then it looks like this is what I'm climbing next to get to the 7,900 feet. Whoa. It's been a pretty big, good climb out of Walker Pass. Whoo! Powder? Well, it's done here. <laughs> You in a powder? I need the powder. Man. You gotta get away from powder, boy. <laughs> I'm just trying to get to this view. All right, so we're out of saddle before we climb this monster. That is Ridgecrest down there. I'm really tired because I just took a break. What are you doing over there? Getting powdered up? Powder? Powder, Powder boy? <laughs> yes, Mr. Jenkins. Oh, I mean white chocolate. Ridge Crest. Pretty cool. Yeah, it is. Come up here. Stupid rain jacket on. I got to take it off. So I can put it back on again in 10 minutes. Pretty awesome. Looks like Simpson clouds. The Simpsons. Nice. Pretty cool section. Trying to get up this Mount Jenkins. 7,900 feet before it pours on us. White chocolate's got something to say. <laughs> That's a hiker dab. <laughs> I think so. Finally to this canyon with the Rocky Mountains. Probably hit about 20 something miles today. But yeah, mountain climbing. Up, down, up, down. But you get some cool views. Ain't gonna get these views. Unless you come up here. Oh, cool, we got some horses on the trail. Been following their poop. Cool, cool. I think Chad's up there talking to him. He is. Got to throw a shout out to Scott and Brittany, friends from home. They need to get out here and ride this trail from Walker Pass to Kennedy Meadows. Pretty damn cool horse trail. With killer views. Be a little scary if you never rode alongside cliffs. But coming up to the horses and White chocolate right now, around these corners, I believe, unless they take off. Oh, hello. Chad, you, uh, you gonna ride a horse now? So we came over that beast and walk. We're coming down really steep, and in the distance, that's Lake Isabella. And down here, this is either part of Weldon 
or cane break. Pretty steep downhill right now. Been lucky, we only got a little bit of rain. So I gotta put the phone away so I don't do a face plant down this steep mountain.